we reveal the challenges behind sex in space. Meet Steve and Lexi, two highly experienced astronauts assigned on a three-year space expedition. After months of isolation in extremely close quarters and with no privacy, the inevitable happens. The first sex experiment in space takes place. Being weightless in space inspires Steve and Lexi to try new creative positions. However, physics immediately takes over and they struggle to stick together. When Steve gives Lexi the slightest push, Lexi is sent floating in the opposite direction. Fortunately, Steve is prepared with elastic bands. He straps himself and Lexi to the shuttle and to each other. The next discovery they encounter is their lack of blood flow in zero gravity. Since in space blood rises to the head and chest, Steve and Lexi find it rather difficult to get aroused below the belt. It also doesn't help that when in space, all men face decreased testosterone levels that lowers their libido. So, even with all his excitement, Steve struggles to maintain a full erection. Lexi also learns about space shrinkage as she sees that certain body parts on Steve appear smaller. This is due to lower blood pressure. When Steve and Lexi can finally get some astronaut-on-astronaut -astronaut action, things get abnormally hotter and sweatier than usual. Their bodies have no natural convection to carry away the heat, so as they continue to perspire, they create pools of moisture that will separate and spread with every move. During physical activities in space, the astronauts get exhausted quickly. Due to microgravity, their heart doesn't have to pump blood as vigorously throughout the body like it does on Earth. This makes Steve and Lex's hearts shrink over time, making the rest of their muscles weaker, which is why they're winded and fatigued. The last and ultimate challenge is to conceive. However, high levels of radiation in space can cause cell deformation and mutation in the bone structure of a fetus. Steve and Lexi have not gone all the way just yet, but they are not giving up on this mission. They plan to avoid the acrobatics and conserve energy. With the help of special straps and a fun choreography, it's only a matter of time before they succeed. Sex in space may be more complicated than imagined, but it's definitely quite a workout and vital for future space exploration and the sake of mankind.